Hello and welcome to another episode of Verification Corner. I'm Rustin Leno. When we write a program, we, we, we very often jump into the, to the editor and start writing code right away. Today we're going to look at, at modeling the code first so that we can get a, a good picture of that we're doing the right thing. And the model can be refined into, into the eventual code that is, that's going to run on the computer. Here we go. <laughs> I'm Bruce Leno. I'm Jean-Raymond Abriel. So, um, Jean-Raymond, you've been um, you've invented an, a number of, um, of formalisms for, for developing programs and reasoning about programs. Uh, the the Z notation that is uh, well uh, well known in, in some circles, and the um, uh, and the B method. Could you say something about where where has the B method been used? Uh, the B method has been used essentially um, mainly in um, in uh, train systems. Mm -hmm. In particular, um, 10 years ago in the uh, line 14 of the, of the metro line in Paris, and more recently, um, there have been some other up abroad, but more recently also the, the shuttle at the Charles de Gaulle airport. Uh -huh, right, yep. so for those viewers, uh, when you're in Paris next time, uh, check out um, the CDG shuttle and uh, line 14 and you'll see where, um, where the software uh, came from. It's very impressive because there is no drivers. Mm, right, <laughs> yeah, then you want it to be correct. <laughs> sure. <laughs> okay, so after the B method, uh, you did um, uh, event B, and that's what we're going to look at today. Uh, could you uh, say something about what motivated you to do event B instead of the, the B method? Uh, the motivation is um, to um, have the possibility to model um, the, an, an entire uh, system, not only the, the software, but the, but the complete system. In the case of, um, we mentioned before, the Line 14 and the, um, and the shuttle, mm -hmm. uh, the, the system study was done uh, by, by professionals, of course, but, but without using any formalism. Mm -hmm. So if there has been, there, has, there is not, fortunately, an error there, uh, this would not have been taken by the, the, the uh, further development. Mm -hmm. So we want to, we want to improve the, the approach in uh, doing some, um, some more work on the top of it. Mm -hmm. right. All right, so we're going to uh, look at event B today uh, as implemented in the, in the Rodan tool. And, um, and um, um, please show me what, what you have. Yeah, so, so the idea is to present a small, a small example um, the, the idea of event B is, is not directly to code, but it's to observe a situation. And the situation we're going to observe here is um, the one in a bank. Um, so we are going to define a little, um, we are going to define a little, a little bank. So uh, the project is named, um, is named bank. And, um, and when you enter in a, in a bank, you, you see people, and uh, you, you see people um, uh, um, taking care or asking questions about their, their, um, their account. Mm -hmm. So the first thing to do in, in our case is, is to define precisely um, uh, these, um, these elements. So we, we define a so-called context where we um, call, let's call it C0, where we define um, the um, two sets uh, that are the, the a priori the set of person and the set of accounts. Um, so, so these are the two things that we observe in a bank and the, in your description of it. Yeah, exa mm -hmm. exactly, exactly. So let's call them PRS uh, for short and ACT um, uh, for, um, for accounts. Uh, once we've done this, we could, um, we could save this and we can, we can see here on the right that C0 now is, um, is inserted into, um, into the platform. Mm -hmm. And now we are going to define um, um, a precisely, um, precisely our bank. In order to do this, we just define a, a so-called machine called bank zero. Why zero? Is because we, we will have several steps mm -hmm. where, where we, we are going to refine, and, and um, Rustin, you, um, you, you could help me also defining exactly what what refining means mm -hmm. um, in order to achieve um, our goal. So we enter um, into this bank zero, and, and now what we have to do is to define the state of our bank. So the state of our bank is essentially made of accounts. Mm -hmm. So we define some, some variables 
um, let's call this variables account ACT and, and ACT there is no ACT at the beginning so this is the, the initialization and ACTs are um, um, included into ACT uppercase um, um, and so this is this is our way to define uh, the the, um, um, the the account mm -hmm. and now we are going to add more things um, about precisely an ACT an ACT has got an owner an account has got an owner there is no owner at the beginning and um, our owner is a function it's a total function from ACT to um, some uh, or to some to some person PRS mm -hmm. and um, and the second thing about an account of course is a balance uh -huh. so we are going to add um, another uh, variable BAL and BAL is um, empty to begin with and BAL is a function from ACT to um, to um, to natural number. So what we have here is in an object-oriented language you might write the capital ACT and PRS as two classes and in that case the, the lowercase ACT and PRS would be uh, the the created uh, instances of those classes, the uh, the allocated ones. Exactly. So this is this is our state, but we have not seen yet mm -hmm. when do we um, enter precisely a new ACT, mm -hmm. and and so we have to we have to again observe what what's going on in a bank, and what we can see is that um, some some new people coming into town, um, they want to open an account. Mm -hmm. So this will be the first thing. But before showing that to you. I would like to uh, show what we've done so far. So mm -hmm. you, you can see here on the screen that we have ACT, ACT, an account, owner, BAL, and we have the, um, the invariant corresponding to this, and we have the um, initialization. Uh -huh. And what happened to the context? Uh, the context? The context is seen by the... Um, by, uh, I forgot to do that. Thank you very much, uh, Rustin. So I have to do C0 here is, is, is C. Um, what you can see is we have a little star here, which means that um, this is not saved yet. We'll, we'll do that a little later. Okay. So, so now what we are going to do is to enter some uh, transition. Uh, for uh, uh, f the first transition um, of, of in, in our system is to precisely create a new, uh, a new account. So we have an event, it's called an event, and let's call it open. And for opening, we have two, a number of parameters, P and A. Uh, P is a, a person, and A is an account which is not yet a, a real account. So A um, does not belong to ACT. Mm -hmm. so um, this will um, create a, a new account. Then. This will create a new account. And, and now we have, to, we have to enter information for, on that account. The owner of A is is precisely uh, Mr. P mm -hmm. and the balance ah what what kind of balance do we have when we start a new account well no money mm -hmm. so so the bal of A is just um is is just um uh, zero mm -hmm. so the uh, the actions that you've listed here owner of A and bal of A uh, get P and, and zero in an object oriented language, we might write those a dot owner and a dot balance, for yeah. example. But yeah. it's the same thing. Yeah, here. it's exactly the same thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, so, so this is this is the open action, and of course there is the reverse action, which is closing. Some people are leaving the town, so uh, they close their account. So we have to we have to add another event, which is called close, and um, and close um, corresponds to. Um, to um, uh, uh, an account, and um, what when we close, what we have to do is to forget about um, a bal and forget about owner. So owner, the owner function uh, becomes equal uh, a withdrawn from the from the domain um, of owner, mm -hmm. and the same for and the same for bal. Um, so bal becomes uh, a withdrawn from um, from BAL. Mm -hmm. So this and is like uh, getting rid of the storage associated with those two cells. E exactly, exactly. And we, we might, we, we might maybe, the, maybe the person doesn't want to, to lose money, mm -hmm. so as, as an additional uh, guard, mm -hmm. um, we could put that BAL of A 
is of ball of A is equal to is equal to zero. Mm -hmm. So the guard does what? Oh, the guard are the, are the necessary condition for the for the event to be enabled. Uh -huh to be triggered. Mm -hmm. So the close cannot happen unless the, the balance is zero. Uh, unless the balance is zero. Um, um, so now what we've, we have done that, we can, we can say OK here. And if we have a look at the, the events, we, we, we have the initialization as before, but we have now open, open and close. Mm -hmm. uh, what is very interesting now is to have a look at, um, at the proof. Um, um, let, me, let me say a little more about this notion of proving. Um, in in, the, in the, the definition of our um, of our bank, we define a number of invariant act for act owner and ball, and we also def so this is a static part of the of the system. Um, this is the laws that must that must be maintained all the time in spite of the uh, transitions, mm -hmm. and we have we have incorporated two transition well an initialization and two transition. There is no reason a priori for this invariant here, the inv1, inv2, and inv3, to be maintained. Oh. So we have to do a proof here. Mm -hmm. And so in order to do this, um, uh, I have, I'm, I'm going now to um, save uh, my, my bank machine. Mm -hmm. And um, um, I, will, I will get, oh, I, I got lots of trouble here, as we can see. Um, we have, um, um, uh, when it is green, it is proved, and when it is red, it is not proved. So here we have things that are not proved. So let's have a look um, uh, at what's, what's going on here. Um, and here, um, let's go on to proving. Um, um, ah, yeah, um, oh. oh, yes, yes, I've, I've made a mistake, of course. I, I forgot to, um, to, um, to enlarge uh, ACT. Ah, okay, so, so you used the storage, but you did not include a new reference to that's the, right, that's right. So you see here we have we have the um, the proving environment. Here we have what what is to be proved, and we have the assumptions about about this proof. Uh, we can we can see that um, here we have the 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 events, and what we what we have to prove is the maintenance of this of this invariant. Mm -hmm. And this could not be done uh, b because what I've said. So what we have, so what is important is to go is to be able to go back and forth from proving and modeling, proving, modeling exactly what you do when you program, uh -huh. where you go back and forth between testing, debugging, testing, debugging, testing, debugging. So in in modeling, um, uh, we have no execution as you as you've seen, but mm -hmm. we have proofs, mm -hmm. and proofs play exactly the same role as um, as testing. Mm -hmm. Um, so here we go back to our, our system, and we are going to um, to um, add to open um, <coughs> the, the fact that um, that um, uh, our act becomes equal act union a. Mm -hmm. And let me guess, uh, the problem that we're seeing with the invariant for close is similar. Yeah. Uh, probably. Probably, um, let's let's have a look at close. Uh, let's have a look at close and what I've done in close. Ah, yeah, I, I forgot. I forgot simply to um, put act colon equal act set minus a. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's uh, cross our fingers and let's uh, do a, a proof now. And ah, I, ah, no, you see, now it's, it's all green. All green. Um, and uh, you see a little mm -hmm. A here, which means that the proof has, has been, have been done automatically. Mm -hmm. OK, so we, we have opened an account, and we've closed an account. Mm -hmm. So now, of course, we want to deposit some money in the account and withdraw some money in the account. Mm -hmm. So we are going to add now more events. So the first events we are going to add is call deposit. Um, we deposit on a certain account, and we deposit a certain quantity of money Q. Mm -hmm. So A is an account, and Q is a, a is a natural uh, is a natural number. Okay, and this is very simple. Val of A becomes equal val of A uh, plus plus Q, mm -hmm. just just like this. And uh, and remove is is exactly the same. So here, withdraw, withdraw, and we have um, we have a, a P, um, we have a, 
and we have Q. So A is A, A is an account, and and Q is um, sorry, and Q is a um, equity of money. And here we do exactly the same as before. Bal of, of A uh, becomes equal bal of A uh, minus uh, minus Q. Mm -hmm. Okay. But now I remember that um, bal is um, is a map from accounts created accounts to natural numbers. Uh, is that an invariant that we really are maintaining in this case? Oh, oh you're right, Tristan. You're right. I'm, oh, thank you very much. I would have made a mistake. Of course, of course. I have to say here that Q is smaller than or equal to to bal of a, uh, because we want uh, we want bal to be uh, to be a natural number, mm -hmm. so it cannot be negative. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, thank you very much. I and I that. presume that would have come out in the in the proof had we uh, pressed the save button. Oh yes, yes, right. sure, sure, certainly. Mm -hmm. Well. Hopefully. So let's let's see now um, um, what happens. Oh yes, uh, of course everything is green now. Great. Uh, great. Yeah, yeah. So so now we have the basics of, of our of our of our bank. Mm -hmm. We can open, close an account, and um, uh, deposit some money and withdraw some money. Mm -hmm. Okay. So so the next step in sometimes um, uh, I'm sure you've done it. I'm, I'm, I've done it also. When you go to your bank and you have a friend or some other people who who have an account on the same bank. And you, you say, uh, could you move um, uh, rather than removing money, taking it and giving, putting the money uh, to the account of, or giving directly the cash to the person, mm -hmm. we want to have a, a, an account-to-account -account um, uh, moving. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, so this is what we want to do now. Mm -hmm. um, uh, but this operation is, is, is not exactly withdraw uh, followed by deposit. Uh, because because the two person or the, the, the two accounts could could be um, in different branches of the bank, so they might be far away. Mm -hmm. So in between the two, uh, the money is put internally into into the bank in, sort, in some sort of, of a pipe. Ah, mm -hmm. Okay, so this is what we have to do, um, and this is something new because because we have the basics and and now we want we want to add these uh, functionalities. Mm -hmm. So in order to do that, uh, we are going to refine. Uh -huh. uh, but the refinement will be something simple. This is this will be an extension of the system we have so we have so far. So let's let's do this. So we go into bank zero here and we um, and we refine here. We refine bank zero with uh, with bank bank one. Mm -hmm. Okay. And what happens with bank zero when we do that? Does it go away or does it stay there? No, no, it stay it stay it stay there. It's on, on the top. It or you, you have to think you have to think of this bank zero, bank one, bank two, etc. as um, as zooming on, on the system, exactly like the blueprint for an engineer mm -hmm. or an architect. Uh, we have now a more precise blueprint, um, a, a, a second version of, of our model, and this is precisely uh, bank one. Mm -hmm. So if we want to go back and look at the, at the simpler operation, zooming out as it were, uh, we can go back and, and look at bank zero. Oh, sure, 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 sure. Right? Mm -hmm. They will be behind the curtain now, mm -hmm. but they will be still there. Mm -hmm. so, so we go now into, um, into bank one. So bank one is delivered to us. As you can see, it it, it refines bank zero. Um, it sees C zero, the same the same context. It has it has got all the variables and um, um, uh, no invariant because because precisely the invariant that we define in bank zero are still there. Mm -hmm. And and as far as the events are concerned, all, all the events are are exactly exactly the same so far. Okay. So so now we want to we want to move um, we want to move some money from one account to another one. And as I've said before, this is done in two steps. So we, we, we shall have a, 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 f a, first, a first event, move one. Mm -hmm. But we, we, move one is, a, is essentially a withdrawal. So we do, want, we do not want to repeat this. Mm -hmm. So in fact, what we define move one as an extension of, of precisely of withdrawal. So here, we, um, we, we refine, um, we refine um, or withdraw mm -hmm. here we refine withdraw and and now what we have to do is to explain what we do uh, when we move um, you remember we remove some money from from a when we withdraw and now we we want to put some money into another account uh, let's call it let's call it B uh -huh. okay so B B is is is, is an account um, B is an account 
B. So, so one way to think about this is that move one has an additional parameter uh, B, which is going to be the, the destination that exactly. we're moving to. E e exactly. And there is no point in having B equals to A, so we could just say uh, we could just say B, B is, um, is 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 different from from A. Mm -hmm. Okay. And now, where are we going to put that money? Ah, uh, well, uh, that's precisely the point. Um, I, I mentioned this this notion of a pipe mm -hmm. between uh, um, uh, in, in the bank. So we have to define a new variable. So you see here, this is a proper of a superposition refinement. We add functionalities here, move one, but also we extend our state, and this will be done by adding a new a new variable. Let's call it uh, let's call it in bank in bank. Okay, um, it's um, it's empty to begin with, and it's a, it's a binary relation between act and um, and uh, and some some numbers, mm -hmm. uh, uh, not. Okay, and um, and we add this. Uh, this the, uh, as you can see, it is it is added automatically after the wizard, and and now we we can we can do um, we can add um, this. Um, uh, this money into in in bank, um, um, corresponding to precisely the um, um, the account um, the account of, of B. So we add the little um, uh, the little maplet of B uh, or Q. Mm -hmm. Remember, Q was a parameter of of um, of, of, of move of um, uh, of wind of withdraw. And uh, now it seems that seems okay. Uh -huh. um, let's, uh, but we have to do the proof. We always have to do the proof, uh -huh. okay? And uh, um, so we just save this, okay? And ah, uh, there is a problem. And what is the problem? This I don't know. Uh, it's enclosed, but, but but how come that it, it is enclosed? I don't understand. Uh, because clo it is completely independent. Can we take a look at close? Um, uh, at this at this proof, yes. What happens to the money in the pipe when we're closing? Ah, <laughs> I forgot. I forgot to remove the money in the pipe. Uh -huh. I, I forgot to, to remove A from the pipe. Okay, so here um, uh, the, the what we what we can do is very clear. We can uh, we can do a, a close precisely when there is no money in a close of a certain account A, when there is no money uh, for that account in the pipe. Mm. So here, what we would, that we would say, we will add a guard, we will not change anything else, we will, and this is still an extension, that A is, is not, does not belong to the domain of the in-bank. Uh -huh. So now that uh, the close event is enabled um, only for, um, for, money, for accounts that do not have have money in transit in that that's bank. better that's better to, to do this so we suppose we suppose that the, the, the management in the bank they have the possibility to access the, 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 the pipe and, and see this mm -hmm. okay so let's have a look whether this will solve the problem okay here here and that solves the problem very oh good. that's very nice mm -hmm. okay so we have a similar operation um, we, we have defined move one um, and and now move move two. Is, is a similar operation for um, for putting the money now in, in B. Mm -hmm. uh, we can we, we, we can skip that because it's 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 uh, it's very much the same. Okay, so our viewers can do that at, at home. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's it's easy now. People can do that. Mm -hmm. um, 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 and now the, the next step is the following. Uh, um, I see sometimes some people who go to the bank and they um, they open two two kind of account, um, um, a normal account and a savings account. Huh? Oh, and, and what, what they want to do precisely is to save money. And when they save money, they move money from their normal account to the savings account. Uh -huh. Okay, and so again, this is, this is something new, so we are going to refine. Uh -huh. We are going to refine again. So here we, are, um, we, have, we, we had bank one, and so now we refine bank one into, um, into bank two. Bank, bank two. Okay, so we, we'll do that. Um, and, and but now you see we add for an account a new um, a, a, a new component for an account the the, the kind of this account. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what we have to do is to define precisely uh, this kind. In order to do this, we are going to extend the context C zero uh, by another context which is called um, uh, obviously C one, 
and um, and in C1 we are going to add a um, an, an enumerated set um, which is um, uh, called kind in uppercase kind and um, it has got two elements normal mm -hmm. and um, and savings mm -hmm. okay and uh, and that's it and so it's it's interesting to see the way it is done um, we can we can see that we have the set kind we have the two constants normal and savings mm -hmm. and the connection between normal and savings and kind is just de defined by this action that the, the 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 singleton normal and singleton savings partition kind. Oh, that seems uh, like a useful predicate there. Partition. Yeah, mm -hmm. partition is a, is a nice concept in mathematics. It, it's very useful. Mm -hmm. So in fact, the union of these two singleton is exactly equals to kind, mm -hmm. and the intersection of these two singleton is empty. Mm -hmm. Therefore, saving and, and, and savings and normal are are different. So now we've um, we've done um, the right thing. So. We go back to bank two, and now bank two, um, we have to um, to see C1. And uh, you remember C1 extends, we can see this, we can see this here. C1's, um, um, C1 extends um, or C, C0 here. We can see that here. And so um, um, we can, we can um, we, when we see in bank two, when we see C1, in fact, we see C02 by transitivity. Mm -hmm. So let's save C1 and let's go back to bank two. And now in, ba in bank two, we have to do this, this uh, saving. In fact, s what is saving? Saving is withdrawing money from your normal account mm -hmm. and, and intending to, to put it in your savings account. So it's exactly a refinement of... of um Move of move one, mm -hmm. so so we should do that. Okay, so here we go into our um, our events, and we add we add uh, save. There is no there is no reason to add save one and save two because save two the second part of it is done is done by move two the one we have done not 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 implemented yet. Mm -hmm. So s save is in fact um, an extension. Of um, of move one, so you see we we have save is an extension of move one, and move one was an extension of of withdraw. So we we have two ex, uh, two extension here, mm -hmm. and um, or, or saves now refines uh, move one, refines move one, and um, and and now we have to do various things. We already have two accounts in move one, but what we have to say is that the um, the owner, the owner of A is equal to P. P, remember, was a parameter of, um, of, um, of move one. And the owner of, of, of B is also um, Mr. P. Mm -hmm. And was, the, was P a parameter of, uh, of move one? Um, yeah, yeah. P, P was a parameter of move one. If if we are not sure, we can have a look at it. Mm -hmm. So let's have a look here. Um, um, no, you're right. It was not. Um, it was a parameter, in fact, of um, of. Uh, uh, let's have a look here. Mm -hmm. Move one. Um, ah, no, 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 no. Uh, P. P didn't exist. P did not exist. Oh, sorry. So we just did accounts. Oh before. yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you very much, Rustan. I made you know, I made many errors. <laughs> That's fortunate you're here. <laughs> so so in fact, um, um, we have to we have to say that uh, P uh, P is a certain uh, P is a certain person. P belongs to P R S, mm -hmm. and we have, we better. Uh, move this on on top here. Mm -hmm. So P is a person. O is P. O of B is P. Mm -hmm. and, um, and and you want to introduce P as well for um, the in the in the any section, I believe, to declare. Oh yeah 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 yeah. I have to, I have to do that too. Yeah mm -hmm. yeah. Excellent. Uh, and and now ah I forgot to I forgot to add the kind in in a um, in, in in an account. So I have I have to add a new variable. Which is called kind, little kind, okay, and uh, it's empty, and it's it's a function, it's a total function from account to kind in uppercase, mm -hmm. okay. 
So I do this, but if I do this, I have also to add it into, into the opening. When you open your account, it, it's either an account, um, a savings account or a, a, a normal account. Mm -hmm. So here I have a new parameter, K, a new parameter K, and um, I say that K, K is a kind, and uh, moreover, I'm going to say that kind of A is equal to K. Mm -hmm. okay. So in the original uh, model, bank zero, that, that kind did not exist because mm -hmm. we did not zoom into that level of detail. But here we see it and you uh, superimpose those actions into the, into the open event. Exactly, mm -hmm. exactly. And, and this is the key, you know, of, the, of this approach, that it is not possible to envisage everything at the beginning. So we, we, we move slowly, as you've seen, we've moved slowly. And each time I wanted, I say, oh, we could add this functionality. And because of we add the functionality, then we extend the state and we have to do uh, various modification here and there. So uh, in, in, order, in close also, I have to do a modification. Um, um, I have to say that, um, kind colon equal a withdrawn of from from kind mm -hmm. okay and now I can I can go back down to uh, down to uh, where we were and so here we say that the kind of a is equal to normal mm -hmm. this is what we do when we save and the the kind of B kind of, of B is equal to savings. Savings. Okay. So so when we save, I'm a person, I'm the owner of A, I am the owner of B, A is normal and B is savings. Mm -hmm. And I think it's it's all we we do not have to, to change anything because as we as you remember the, the quantity is already there and the quantity is uh, put in the in the pipe, mm -hmm. and and so things will be will be done. Let's have a look at the um, at the proof to be sure. Mm -hmm. It seems to be okay. Oh, you, ah, you see, there we are. yeah, yeah, here oh, we are. Very good. So now you've developed a model into something that has the right functionality. Yeah. Um, but if we're eventually going to get this model into something that we could implement. Um, I would probably not implement it with, with these different variables, um, kind and owner and so forth. I, I would probably have a record for, for, for each account. Can we do that instead? We can do that. Mm -hmm. We can do that. And then uh, we have to start over, maybe? Um, we, we, it's, it's, it's yet another refinement. Oh, uh -huh. It's called a data refinement, because now we are not going to add any functionalities. We are not going to extend the state. In fact, we are going to shrink the state mm -hmm. by, um, as you said, removing bal, removing own, owner, re and removing kind, and changing it to a file. So it's it's a little longer to do it. So I've I've, I've done it on, on uh, another development, and it's it's just here. So this is bank three here, and and what bank three does um, can be seen here. We you, you see the, the variables now um, um, owner. Um, a bal and kind of disappeared, and they have been replaced by by a variable file. Mm -hmm. And file is goes from 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 an account to a Cartesian product, person, natural number, and kind. And this Cartesian product is in fact exactly the record That's that exactly. is in 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 the file. How nice! Yeah, and and of course now what I have to do is to 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 do to glue the owner bal and kind to the file. And this is called precisely the gluing invariant. We are gluing the invariant. We are gluing the variable of this level, bank three, to the variables at, at the previous level, bank two, bank z one, and bank zero. And I say the file of A is a triple owner of A, bal of A, and kind of A. Oh, excellent. And, and of course, now I have to simplify the, the various things. For example, uh, let's have a look at um, open and open. Um, you, you see here, file of A becomes a triple P zero K, and the and we have similar um, modification. It's e even simpler here for close. We just um, we just re remove A from from the file, mm -hmm. and as you can see here, we are not anymore into an extensions of of the events. 
are this, they, they, you can see all of them, they are not, um, uh, they are not extended. Mm -hmm. So that's it. Now we have something which is not completely ready to be implemented, but, but close to be implemented. So you see the approach. The approach is to do um, um, uh, superposition refinement to extract from the requirements the various uh, functionalities. And when it is finished, when we have incorporated all, all the, the, the requirements, mm -hmm. then we can go into um, a data refinement and eventually some, some code. Uh -huh, right. Now you've mentioned a couple of times that the, the proofs take the place of, of testing here. Yeah. Uh, and so far, all the, the proofs have been automatic. But it could happen that, that some proofs uh, would have to be done manually. Is that so? Yeah, well, here, um, in, this, in this bank, in, in this development where I have Bank 3, we, we have the, the following statistics. Uh, you can see that um, the, all these require 36 proofs out of which 35 are done automatically, and just one was done manually, yeah. um, uh, precisely um, in, 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 in the end. Sorry, I've just shown you of bank three here. Uh, the overall proof is this, 60 proof, 59 proof automatically, and one manually in, in, in bank three. Uh, in fact, it's a, bit de it's a small deficiency of, of the Rodin platform, uh, because uh, the, the prover um, has, a, um, has a time limit, uh, the automatic proof has a time limit, and it was it was not at all it was not sufficient um, in this case. So this proof has, had to be done um, um, had to be done ma um, uh, manually. Manually means that we just we just direct a little the automatic proof in in order to um, fi uh, finalize the proof. Mm -hmm. So you see one one manual proof which is done in three four clicks out of 60, so it's, it's about 90, 89%, mm -hmm. 90, 98% of, of done automatically. Uh -huh. And we could compare that to the, to the testing effort, uh, that it would probably take uh, a little bit more than a few clicks to, to write the test suite for, for something similar. Yeah, and the, and the, main, the, the, main, difference, the main difference is, is that the proofs that we've proved but have been generated by a tool called the Proof Obligation Generator. Mm -hmm. So whereas when you test, you have to precisely to define the test suite. So, so you have to define your tests, and you could forget something. Whereas here, this is completely um, automatic. So the tool um, does this. You have seen the interaction with the tool. And then the, there is this, um, um, this uh, proof obligation generator. And then the proof obligation generator uh, uh, send through a pipe or through a file uh, to the automatic prover what is to be proved. And, uh, and eventually, the prover um, works uh, automatically. In this case, it was quite good. Thank you very much. Okay. <laughs>